And welcome back, welcome back. We are here uh, once again for some more um, CSV6 planet side. I'm still at Epic, I'm still with Hospray, and we will have a different matches. The first one was kind of this uh, bit uh, sketchy in terms of the produ uh, production side, but here we will have like the, um, the script is running uh, and he's working fine. Uh, let's hope and we have two uh, team that are veterans I would say of the 6v6 formats Way more experience at least yet Yeah, so yeah. for the teams we'll have uh, DDRV or DDRG sorry uh, DDRV with, uh, will be their um, outfit name and uh, outfit tag, sorry, and we will have a uh, joke uh, as well. So they will be facing joke playing VS versus TR. Yep. Uh, so unfortunately, the yep. Is, if you want me to present a bit. Yeah, we only the have the, the the joke roster uh, as displayed on your screen. Fortunately, we don't have the DRV. Yep. So playing today are Slendy, Aflec, Ryan. Zyros, Wanjo, <laughs> HQO, <laughs> and uh, the f last one is, uh, who is it? It's Coach. So pretty strong lineup. I'd say it's about the best they can bring right now because <laughs> most of their players are rusty and need to play a bit more the game again. Yeah. So like people like uh, Imhan, Shelm might not be like in top top four. Yeah. And DBO as well. And on <laughs> the other side, since you don't have DDR gaming, so yeah, it's basically people from X Tac and Co. So that's uh, Doctor Psycho, actually as Doc P, uh, Itzy, will be playing uh, Netrox. Then we have Essing Power, uh, Yolda with the Bolt, I think. And who am I missing? Jokrima. Yes. Yes, uh, we were you, uh, we were missing Jokrima here into the lineup of uh, that uh, VS team. I think um, DDRG will be playing um, VS and Joke will be playing TR. The ba the the base is set up, so yeah, we just need uh, and will be the starting in, uh, in um, seventy seconds. Sorry. So let's so jump. Five, right. five kph will be joke and DDRV. Well, it's DDR gaming. Yes, yes, indeed. And as you can see, the script is working. The script yeah. is working. <laughs> Finally, we will have like an interesting match with uh, with scores and thing like this. That's going to be a great. Thirty seconds. Yes, at the next deposit here. Both teams are getting ready. I, I can make your account down if you want. Oh yes, that will be perfect. Oh wait, go on next thirty. They say so. All right, so I... at zero. Oh, 
speak up scam. <laughs> <laughs> VS, uh, is that mandatory to run like the, the uh, stealth module or is that uh, team preference? Uh, I think it's going to be applied to rules. So we start mm. in 20 seconds. I think it has been applied in rules. Yeah. Since we're in pre-season, we're tolerating that, but I think it's going to be mandatory on the tournament. Yes, yes. So we'll be watching the VS side starting and first. Five seconds. You ready? Yeah. yeah. Four, three, two, one, and start. There we go. There we go. Start. And that's. Uh, that will, uh, VS will be running the double LA. So oh, uh, the control so the of the roof will be insane, and there it is the the, the jump oh, hack to get onto the roof of Ice Shelp. Oh. oh, coach wiping them up on the roof. Yeah, but one LA is down for the TR. One LA is down for the TR. The, I think there is the bolter from uh, onto the roof of V shape. But TR are in control of uh, ground floor into yeah, the L shape. Pretty risky from the TR Heavy going for the cap, knowing that the VS bolt is on the roof. The yeah, he's, he's on the roof of I shape. Uh, yep. or yes, oh, there it is. He's right there. Doesn't yeah, have a really great line of sight though onto the point. Oh, nice switching the aggression between two LAs. <laughs> the, point the, the point is frozen. The point is frozen, unfortunately. Oh. That's a pick for the BS, but traded from the LLA and the LA battle is definitely getting won by TR right now. Although, yeah, beautiful Zyros double kill. To Zyros. Can he do it with the pilot against Dr. Psycho? No oh, way! Okay. No way! <laughs> he done this. Beautiful move by the TR here and to regain control of the, uh, the L shape. Itzy going for the LA. I didn't see that Itzy was the second LA for VS. Uh, dropping on the balcony. How is it going on the inside? One for one trade for now. Oh, Slendy on the bolter, making it work. Oh, that's not Slendy, that's Ryan, my bad. And Tiar back in control again. Yeah, back in control of that H shape, and they will be pressuring uh, the I shape and V shape here onto the, the base. Kill from Ryan. Big team kill. <laughs> That's still a joke in advance, plus nine in their favor with a strong cap going on. No, it's flipped. Uh, VS trying to push by the by the V shape here. Uh, one of V was into that building. Where is he? He disappeared. Big trade, one for one. Oh, and coach gets the double kill on Itzy. And that's the LA, the LA's of TR getting total control right now. VS is losing a lot on those LA's right now. Yeah, yeah, it's, uh, running the double LA. Um, bo both teams are running the double LA and uh, they are just insane right now. Oh uh, my god, for I don't the know if you call that on the I shape inside. Slendy just. Bunny hoped that heavy and then killed the bolter inside. Wow, well, Ren getting picked by Itzy, so that's VS with at least three picks there. Taking control of the point again, but I don't think they have time to get inside the L shape, do they? No, they... especially there's still a TR heavy there. Yeah, like there's the still a TR onto running. the high ground. Still training though, and Jokrima picking the kill on A flick. Although there's a big push of TR on the bottom floor. That's three picks again for VS. There we go, and we we see a much more experienced team uh, utilizing the the the, the st strange jump onto the uh, onto the buildings. Oh my God, that's beautiful! The patience of that light assault to try to get down um, that infiltrator onto the balcony. Now TR have a good opportunity. There is no bolter anymore onto the roof. Concussion grenade will push back the TR inside the L-shaped building, but there is few heavies waiting for them. Yep, seems to be balancing. Things are balancing a bit. With yeah. uh, Joke still an advantage, but not by that much. And not yes, picking much. up kills right now. Although Zyros inside the L, can he do it on the nest? With the LA on top of him. 
I was wiggling. That's two medkits. He's still up. No Maybe way. With the that's that's still an eight point game. And that's really really close. VS in control of the point right now. So they are they are in good shape. Both teams are still in the run for for that round. And that's really important. One heavy is down right, though for the VS. Off. No, I was about to say picks are going in Tiol's way, but that's three for VS, now four. And five, that's almost a full wipe. I don't know whether that's six person from TR, but yeah, VS back in control of the L. Got the 60s, that LA on the roof. Big chunk of damage on him. The double A going strong. Clever choice running back in from the VS LA there. Yeah, he nearly baited the... Oh my god, he baited him! Nice, beautifully move, uh, play by the um, by the LA off VS, and now it will be oh, it will be killed though uh, in the end by uh, by coach. But that's a mutual kill here, so no point gain for either team. And we have the bolter at the bottom of the L shape building with the uh, the oh, MP. He has a Double good line of sight here. Back again for TR. Oh, and that LA getting peek on Essing, that was totally unaware of that LA on the roof. Although VS took back the control of the roof. Yeah, one LA, LA is down is. for uh, for the TR, but you have still the both LAs for for the VS, one LA. Uh, the, the remaining LAs who try to push inside uh, the L shape, yes, nice since he is inside. Uh, going back onto low ground, I think. Yes, there it is, he's there. Oh my god, the 1v1! That's insane! Has an LA to gain, uh, to, to win those uh, 1v1 against the EV. That's really important. That will allow your team to score two points relatively freely. Yep, TR taking control of the upper floor of the L shape thanks to those double LA back on the roof. When VS only has one, so Itzy has to play defensive. Yep. Oh, now I realize it's all the two picks for VS. That's two point game. Two point game, oh, and the timer is at one minute for the base. Yep, timers is cleverly switched, at least stabilized from TR. Yeah, they needed to. They need really needed to. They are one minute to uh, to the cap, so they had to yeah, make the move. One by Itzy on the roof again. Nice move by. Oh, oh my God, the double kill. Both LA are down. For the VS! Clendy must be on top top scoreboard. Yeah, he is right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's TR in full control of the L right now. Full control, and that's a wipe from VS. That's Only the bolter left on the point in really big trouble right now. Can he do it? No, we can't. Although it's a trade. Getting a trade out of that is really a great job already, because he was about to die. Yeah, now the now the, the VS will, let's say they they will struggle a little bit. Uh, both LAs are on to the either side of the roofs here of the base, so really important. Uh, great crossfire, I would say, by the by the LA provided Ooh, nice pick. on TR. One, LA down. One TR LA is down. Yeah. We see a shift of focus. We see that the LA is from VS now going through the V instead of going L, but that's slendy equaling. The picks. A double by oh, VS is pressure under the tree by some uh, by some heavy. Yes, you will be killed by uh, onto the commissioner. Uh, with the commissioner, sorry, the second LA from the VS is down as well. Now there is a big push from the the VS trying to take back control of the L-shaped building here, but that push might be denied by the TR. That one heavy alone on top. He manages to trade one. That's a trade. Great. That's really important. And one heavy pushing back up. Will he get dropped? No, you shouldn't drop, mate. Stay on top. You have the high ground. Uh, Hobby one can be won his rule against Anakin Skywalker because he had the high ground. So you need to keep that that high ground. <laughs> Yele back on the roof for the VS. A good synchronization by uh, by the LA or oh, of the VS, always in um, together. Uh, 
I uh, want two picks for TR. Can he get a trade? ET gets one, so that's two for one right now. Will he get the second? No! That's TR in, in control again. The L shape being a war zone. Oh, the revenge one. kill, two really important again. here. That's a two yeah. for one. TR for getting the TR. back in control of that game. With us really strong, that's plus 20. Yep. Yeah, we, we had a. a plus two differential at some point for the TR, but now, well, since they got back, um, they got the control back on the, of the L shape, and uh, they were allowed to push a little bit on the V shape and the I shape, uh, the gap has widened a lot uh, between the two teams. I think, I think it especially is since um, VS is starting to wider more their forces, they, they play when a bit more less stacked yeah. As they contest the V as the in the L at the same time, and it allows TR to win more duels. But as I say that, I think takes control of the L shape. Yeah, beautiful and three yes, man push here. With the LA, and now VS in control of the base. Uh, one TR, the bolter is hiding be, uh, behind those boxes. The two, two, yeah, four, too one. much. The LA about to get surprised on the roof. Does he realize this? He replaces just in time. He doesn't see oh, the second one he's though. Gonna get flanked. He's going to get flanked. All the LAs are here from TR. Oh, oh no! The flanker got flank! Yeah, and flanking the flank again! And <laughs> the other LA, the other TR LA has to run away. Oh, that's my game! Nice. Oh, and that's. Uh, we had the light assault from uh, from the VS uh, getting pressured at the beginning of the game. Now it seems that they are basically winning their, their encounters between and both light assault. TR takes control back of the L-shape. Uh, VS, I mean. And still no capture on, on to, uh, onto yeah, the round. It's, it's less than four minutes left. One minute on the cap, and that's a full wipe for VS right now. They might be able to put it off. Yeah, they, they might be, and that might allow them to win. That's a 10-point game here uh, for now to this round. So both teams really well balanced here. Great team effort taking back that L shape on a very good timing for VS. Yeah. Let's see if they can hold now. They have to hold for at least 40 seconds. Oh, that's too ballsy. Yeah. Go back, <laughs> you Mr. Heavy. No, what are you doing? No, why? Why? Why would you do that? Oh, yeah, why would you do that? Three pushing like that was a terrible mistake. That's four picks for TR. Yeah. And only two VS picks. left against four. Now the TR will be able to. Control. Yeah. They, they will be able to, to take back control of the point and maybe a little bit control of the map. The Bolter is uh, joined back here for the VES. Uh, will be putting pressure onto the uh, the, v -sha the the L shape building, sorry. And uh, with a big conk and here. And a battle yes. yeah. by the TR. Uh, we see Reapers from the VS, but oh, nice pick on the LA from the back. But do they realize this second LA? Not before he picks one. And that's a second. Okay. That's a two so for one. That's a two for one. Two for two here. And, um, and TR, that that TR heavy A flake is cleverly going back because he doesn't want to give points as it's a really close game. I think the timer. I don't think they have to steal the time to flip. Mm, he, they the might. Post. The uh, yes, they might. Two minutes timers. Uh, so yeah, they might have sure, like a really important pick there. Mm. And we have the the TR light uh, the the TR light assault yes watching for the point. Uh, any flankers coming uh, from um, the L shape? Yeah, oh, that's a TR totally wiping the VS right now. So that's definitely the half going in their favor. There won't be a cap. Yeah, won't be a cap unfortunately for the for the VS. Could have saved them. Uh, to be fair, one heavy tends to be uh, really greedy onto the VS side. He didn't have to do that move. Uh, don't really recon the name. Uh, now let's see. Now VS, what they have to do is try to get some peaks and just mm. not die. Don't widen the gap. Just, just try get to picks. get a bit closer. Not commit to anything stupid, and try to close the gap so you can play for a second round, but there is Ryan with a really strong spot, and Zyro's flanking. That's you need to picks. do the revenge, you need to do the revenge, yes there is one revenge, so At that's a one for one. Alright, no more cap possible here by either team. Just uh, one for the left, so let's not yeah. die too much. 
It's a picking one. Yeah, both LA's onto the roof of the uh, for the VS. They will be jumping down onto the balcony. One is get jumped on from oh. behind. He managed to win that one v one, which is insane. Now VS have a nice opportunity to get take back control a little bit that game and and At really close, close the, the gap. gap. That's all they need to do. Yeah. Another pick. Oh, team kill. Stay That's safe. pretty unfortunate. Oh, oh yeah, Doctor Psycho on to hit C. The man, the minus three points it really hurts. Yeah, I think that's the second team kill as well. Mm, yeah, uh, it's been. I think it might be the second time that ET got team kill here. And one for one, two for one. Cyrus picks, but at the end of the round, I don't know if the kills counts. So Total end of the round. Yep. And First that's an eighteen finished. points game. There yep. is a scoreboard. Yeah, as, as Nikki said, very chaotic because everything happened all around the L shape. Some more skirmishes on the uh, DV, but definitely all on the I shape. And that's. Wait, how many team kills did I make? That's two team kills here. <laughs> so, yeah, uh, definitely um, both teams. 18 points game. Uh, that's that's really close. That might uh, that might have like um, having a cap here in this game, but be, being so close can re mean the victory or the defeat of uh, of either team. So yeah, I'm really what uh, looking forward for the for the second round, uh, which might be really interesting. Yeah, leaderboard wise, we can see the the very important role of Itzy that has been winning a lot of duels on the roof with his LA with yeah. a plus 16 net score. Uh, on the other side, as I saw, yeah, Slendy and Zyros putting up the work, definitely with HQ just behind as the other. Although I'm pretty surprised that Jokrima got so low. Minus 19 is a lot. Is a lot. Yeah, and uh, and Netrox as well, minus uh, minus 14. Uh, Netrox is the second LA. It's yeah. he uh, let's not say it's he can read him, here uh, a little bit on on LA. Yeah, you. Throughout the throughout the, the first round, you, uh, you you kept on saying Hitsy with the with the nice flank, Hitsy with the double kill, get one, get two, and um, it's kind of, it's kind of true that Hitsy was uh, a, a nice part of uh, why the uh, DDRV was so close into that game because Hitsy maintained the control of the roof for a long time here, onto especially onto L shape, allowing those flanks uh, onto the balcony. Um, I'm trying to calculate though, how is it, I don't understand the net scores, but whatever. <laughs> <laughs> um, I don't get the... why there's a 12 net score and a minus 24 that makes 18, but yeah, maybe I'm just dumb. The, uh, did, did you count the, um, the team kills? I'm trying to figure out. There was at least two team kills. Yeah, team kills make it work. But that's the two team kills exactly, you're right. Okay. 30 seconds. For, uh, before the second round here. And I I hope that they they, they didn't do the uh, their 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 first match onto onto Xenotech Lab and uh, we'll have no, a no, chance no, no, to oh perfect we'll have a chance to watch the a game of those players onto Xenotech uh, Lab which is interesting. Is it live? It's live. Let's go. Oh, shit, sorry. sorry, I didn't do the countdown. <laughs> yeah, don't worry, don't worry. I okay. I was alt tab. <laughs> there it is. Go back to oh, the one, LA's. Oh, one TR ambusher one TR LA changed to ambusher, so is there faster? Trying to surprise the VS. Yeah, VS realizes TR has the control of the roof and don't need to test that. And as I say, that easy picks one. Or the yeah, coach on the other side picked the LA. Oh, there yeah, they, that's, a, that's a three for, uh, for four here on the side of the TR. So TR might have a nice age uh, comparing to the control of the L shaped building. The light vessel, though, onto the roof uh, will be going for VS. One for one with the TR uh, coming in. Okay, I think, yeah, there's gonna be a flash and he's gonna ambush in. 
Oh, and Itzy getting picked. Very strong start for the TR side right now. Yeah, yeah, very, very strong. I don't think that the Ambusher gem jet played a big role here to uh, hollowing those, uh, those um, lights as well to come back quicker onto the onto the field to be really aggressive. But uh, yeah, that's a very strong start from the side of the, the heavies, especially of TR. They are really in control of that L shape and setting up some great crossfires. Although we see a VS push right now, it's two for one in favor of TR. Yeah, pushing onto the low ground here, that's the two for one. The one Another kill team. onto the TR, maybe the revenge onto the stairs, but no, that TR is going no, he's dead! That's a two for two, uh that's a two for oh here by the by the the heavies of VS. Yeah, VS back in control. That should be a wipe or almost almost it. So VS back in control. Let's see how they handle the defense now with their one, some of their forces running back into through the point right now. Big push coming in. Two Both TR like allies on the roof and yeah. two heavies on Against the bottom. Against one. So there is only Hitsy on to light assault for uh, this time. Oh, we I see a don't flank, flank from that heavy from VS. One pick for Yolda and only one. Pretty sad he lost that many bullets. And that's TR back in control. That was a nice idea in that it's pretty sad it took him so many bullets to kill one of the heavies. It could have been really more impactful. Oh, good pick. HQ. Picking Netrox. On the V area. That's a big advantage because if you take the LA down, it delays the repush from VS. Yeah, also delays the, the fact that the other LA has to play more passively uh, in order to not get picks, otherwise the, 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 the LA is to get desynchronized and uh, you will never be able to re-establish control of the roof here. One LA on the Point roof. Wise, the score, the, it, it widened a bit, it's around plus 30 right now, yeah. to and with that push getting... Uh, push getting denied, maybe sorry. one kill the revenge, but no, he turned back! And got the kill here, uh, Cyroth, I think. Uh, yeah, that's a 1v1 right now, LA against Heavy, and he's not trying it. Yeah, no, that was a 2v1, the other LA, I didn't see him, TR coming in and picking that fight, so that's overall a win again for TR. Really holding on that L shape, the point's not ticking for anyone, but I think Strangely they're going enough. To because they, uh, that L shape. T yeah, TR, TR have been in control of the point, uh, of the, the L shape, so they could have been able to let just um, capture the points. So they maybe just don't want to uh, to pressure that point. Big flank coming oh, in from the nice. TR LA. That's beautiful. That oh, nobody that's died, uh, except for Cyrus here. But nobody died from the TR. A beautifully f um, executed flank by the yep. TR. And uh, the push off VS is once again uh, denied. And TR, we, we had a very really close first round. And I really feel like for now, <laughs> the, uh, VS seems to be quite uh, overpowered by the TR. Okay, so what has changed in between those rounds? I spotted two things. So the first one, no one has a vault anymore. Yeah. Everyone went for LAs and heavies. And we see that Ryan got a big chunk of uh, of kills back on it. With the and while Yolda is pretty not picking up the frags. And on the other side, HQ switched to um, uh, Ambusher and allows yeah. some very big flanks for the TR lately. Although right now that's a pick for the VSLA getting traded by Slendy. Yeah, Slendy and gets killed and uh, really VS... Really cleverly run away. <laughs> yeah, yeah, now, now he's conked, so you really need to play passive here. VS back yeah, in control of the L-shape. He's done his job. He has revenge yeah. and just hide and wait for his backup. That's exactly what you need to do. VS strong in the L right now. Three heavies upstairs. Oh my god, that crossfire onto the... The sneaky VS trying to, cop, uh, to, to contest the points. And uh, so we VS might have a cap. Do. We might have a cap. No, no, no. VS just won like four duels at least and, and flip it. Yes, it's 40 seconds. No, no, the, the I don't know. <laughs> it is. Like a really strong. Oh, and Ryan back at the bolt. Yeah, bolt onto the eye shape. Might get surprising. I hope they spotted it. Yeah, now it's known. So they have to hide and not play that window anymore. Netrox with a good pick on HQ. Coach getting traded. That's two for one for VS and in control of the roof with the LAs. 
Yeah, the bolt, uh, the bolt might be pressured at some point here onto the ice ship. They know that he is onto the ice ship. Who's trying to look at for targets onto the onto the window uh, window here? One heavy is hitting behind those crates. Oh, he got shot by Ryan. But Ryan, he needs to watch out. There is one uh, one light assault around him, and uh, that light assault got the back of Slendy running around in the open. H2 picking up one kill, allowing TR to take back control of the L-ship. And that's TR in full control again. Let's see full how control, but now. they are only two. They are only two TR, so a nice good push by the, uh, the VS. There is two VS uh, trying to push right now. It is possible for them to, to retake the, uh, the, the, the L-ship. Oh, ran on the ledge, on the window, is he spotted? He spotted the LA at least. Oh, uh, the LA got surprised me there by the uh, by the TRs here, and uh, yeah, the LA TR. Are doing the work. Yeah, LA T T LA's TR are really doing the job here. Even though he got killed, there is the revenge from the Yevis, and th and that's a two v one, and uh, make it a three for one kill uh, onto the TR. Sorry, so that's really important, and that will be widening the gap, which is okay. Like 40, <laughs> this this is a 40 uh, game now. Okay, so now VS has to regroup. They have control of the L roof, which is pretty strong, but watch out. That flank, will it happen? Network speaking one, going away, clever move. Watch if you don't get picked from the balcony. There yeah, VS count. in control of the upper floors of the L shape. Yeah, Did thanks to the LAs. Thanks to the LAs, LA is going for the flank once again, the TR onto that. Uh, how do you call it uh, the space between the uh, below the two stairs? Uh, nest. Nest. There. I didn't quite remember. <laughs> yes, doesn't realize I think, but they have to touch the point. Thirty seconds left. Mm -hmm. But no, they cannot. I don't think they can. Okay, one is yeah. touching, but Tia is one? back in control of the L shape. Who is touching the point, or uh, who is not touching the point for the TR? Because there is no VS presence onto the point. So the point, the point is not going through for okay. either team. TR going for the aggressive spawn up there. Will it return against oh, them? Slendy, way too aggressive range. here. Essing picking one as well. Not going right. It's not going cool. Yale getting flanked. Ooh, that's really I, close. I feel like TR should reorganize a little bit. They are way too s s scattered around the map, okay, way too VS? staggered as oh, well. Oh, Ryan saving. Ryan might have gotten the the win for VS right now because for TR because he just blocked the heavy from the capturing heavy. the point. Yeah. Ten and seconds. Yeah, There's but two no heavies are pushing from the yeah. from the northern that's side of the. No wait, no, that's, th that's a contest, but no! Ryan is here once again to defend his team, and that's a second, six second cap here. The VS can't really touch in time. Maybe one VS. No, nope. that's going to be that's the cap plus 18. Ryan just saved that gap with the three picks he oh, got. Yeah. All three guys pushing for the point, and now, now VS is getting punished because they committed a lot to try to get back that cap. And. Everyone is back to a spawn log with TR five guys ahead and a big advantage. Yeah, big advantage. That was a 14, uh, a 40 point game. Now that's uh, more than 60. Yeah. Did you add the. Uh, no. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. Okay. Not yet. So you have to count plus 18. Yeah. Yeah, I think we are kind of close to the end of that map, and that's. Uh, there is five minutes the left, uh, so that's five minutes to turn that much points. Yeah, that's impossible to. Like, I will not say impossible. You have to recap the uh, the the base, establish so much control to to wide to to come back into that game for the VS. That's still feasible. It's going to be extremely big. Um, difficult for the VS here, trying to push back once again, I think, into the uh, the L-shaped building, but that's still TR under control. Yep. It's only trades. I only see trades lately. Not, no one taking real advantage. Mm, yep. So that's not in favor of VS at all. If they only trade, it won't, it won't get them back in the game. Zyro speaking one. 
Uh, Zaro's behind the back, but oh my god, the the, the cover from provided from the from Ryan onto the bolt, it's just insane. Yeah. Ryan really has a really good strong uh, second half. Yeah, and he started like kind of weak uh, onto his heavy, uh, but since he switched to a bolt, he has allowed so much for his team to capture a point. He's defended. He has defended some of his uh, from his, his teammates. And um, and yeah, he's focusing picking the LA as well. He's oh, yeah. forcing the LAs to split, and mm -hmm. that's a long idea. There it is. Coach loses the trade. I mean, gets a trade out of it, but both LAs are down for TR. But yeah, they, they, right now there is one LA. His task is to uh, annoy um, annoy um, and Ryan. See a bolter back on the VS side. Mm. Yeah, finally, that might be like the good answer to to Ryan's bolters, but um, might be a, a little bit too late. Definitely. One pick. That's a one for one. That's a good push as well Three from uh, oh. from the um, the southern side of the base. And Yolda picking a third. Okay, that's VS at least for once getting a positive trade. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. the other the the bolter fight. Ryan makes the other, the makes Yolda come back. Ryan back on that high roof, and HQ gets a pick on the other now. That's TR back in control. That uh, Joe Krima not aware. Lack of communication. I really see that there's a bit of lack of communication within DDR gaming right now. Yeah, or at least they they lack information to really communicate. Uh, which sometimes, if you don't have the good info, you can't communicate uh, as at all. And um, oh my god, the uh, light assault here coming onto that heavy. Like again, it's totally in favor of TR right now because it only goes in trades, and trades mm -hmm. just doesn't change the net score and just the yeah, they won't catch up by trades. Yeah, the overall net score needs to be positive for the VS, and they had like an. He, um, s since oh, one what? minute they had an amazing See? time, but when now... I say that there's an issue within comms, Ryan was on the V, v roof, Nitrox just flew on top of him and didn't even contest and went fighting the other LA. Yeah. And he got shot for the other LA, he's back onto V, uh, onto v roof, and but he has the cover of uh, Ryan as well. Hey, yeah, I think might be tilt, I don't know. But Maybe the DDR gaming not really playing a great planet side right now. Uh, not great second half here. The, the first half was much closer, and the gap keep on widening here. One FLA, uh, one LA will not be try out here by the TR, which is kind of uh, kind of intelligent. I do not never try out guys uh, <laughs> in whatever game. I do not try out for a kill. We will get penalty. That's gonna end up in a big win on Paris from Oh Ryan contesting straight at the stairs. Getting one pick. Pushed by I know the two other heavies. What will happen? Let's see. V in the V shape building. So let's have a look at V shape. Uh we have the Bolter Yolda trying to get some kills. Here and there, so, but V uh, V is finally a good push. They they pushed through uh, through V shape. Now there is one heavy onto high shape, trying to contest the points. Uh, he doesn't quite seem to understand. No, someone on his back. He will come back to safety onto uh, V shape. Watch out for the bolter. The one v one with the commissioner against the bolt. Gonna hand onto a draw. That's the end of the match. Yep, that's GG. We need to count the plus 18. So yep, you can add it on the script. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, uh, that's plus 18 for team 2, I think. Which is 18. Interest. Yep. And there we go. Plus 18 for, um, for jokes. And uh, yeah, that's really close to a uh, 100 point game. Uh, that's 291 for DDRV to 386 for. Oh, yeah, yeah, I do have. There we go.
the scoreboard is available right on stream. Let's see, yeah, Ryan went for, like, we can see Ryan, Zyros, and Slendy, like, put up the numbers. On the first half, they were nicely positive already, but 20, 26, and 15, respectively, while Jokrima went for a minus 46, which is... Insane, uh, yeah, scary. yeah, he got far. It's scary, because Jokrima is usually the one of the top scorer for DDRV, I'd say. Yeah, he didn't Itzy really had, like, an... Itzy, Itzy uh, dropped heavily as well, I remember him having, like, plus 16 or something. But yeah, that's overall, I would say thanks to Ryan, because he got a big impact on the roof. Yeah, yeah, the, uh, on the, on to especially onto the second half, um, Ryan, the, the switch was really intelligent to have that second heavy, that, uh, that heavy uh, switching to, to the bolt. Uh, he made a difference, he assured the cap, uh, provided some cover for his allies, and uh, he, was he was playing relatively passively as well, because he was always onto V-shape and I-shape building, uh, onto the roof, and he never tried to really push uh, like a fancy bolt in CQC um, onto the, onto the, the, um, the L-shape or the other I-shape. So really, uh, really, really amazed by the patience of Ryan and um, all the the UTT he has um, he has allowed for his team here onto the second half. Yep. So we have a s uh, the previous match uh, being uh, being onto Xenotech Lab. So, so we uh, we will have to wait. Sadly have to go. For so at least the group ten, I said they have to go for at least the 10-15 minutes around. Oh, I have to move, so I try to be back for the second half of Xeno, but I can't promise stuff. Yeah, don't worry, don't worry. I'll do it as fast as I can. Do you want me to ask someone if they can come and call? No, don't worry, don't worry, come back. I'm as soon as possible. also here, so if you want, oh, hello, oh. Eros. Yeah. <laughs> hello, Eros. <laughs> Suddenly popped into the channel. <laughs> yeah, that's. <laughs> Magic. <laughs> anyway, I'll be back a bit later, guys. Yeah, sure. Ah. So, um, guys, in order to uh, to have the the next base set up, so it would be uh, Xenotech Lab, we'll have a small break and come back as soon as possible uh, for the rematch of DDRV versus uh, HKPH, uh, 5KPH, so uh, DDRG versus Jokes onto Xenotech Lab. Come back in a few minutes. See you later, guys. User joined your channel. Hello. Hi, Nikki.
Hello ladies and gentlemen, we are back here um, for that second match, which is uh, still DDRV versus 5KPH. So we'll be playing on to Xenotech Lab and the game is starting anytime soon. So let's not lose any time and jump right onto Xenotech Lab. One minute remaining before uh, both teams are ready. So... Yeah, they, they they had a little bit uh, a little bit of a break after that amazing run onto Paris. Um, Paris first half was kind of great for for both teams. That was an I believe an eighteen point game. Then uh, into the second half, the switch of Ryan onto his bolter uh, made things easy for uh, for Joe's five kph, uh, allowing them to uh, capture the base so we'll be starting i believe odd zero here the deposit osprey is not here uh fortunately we might be joined by uh, nikki g at some point uh but we don't know it just afk'd did it start yes we did. there we go and there we go the match started and uh Wait. <laughs> User no. joined your channel. Alright. Hello. 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 Did so, you start already? Uh, yeah, yeah, we started with uh, the most it, team. But, uh... So, yeah. Seems that we have like a bit of uh... I reset here. One team was way way too eager to go to go onto the onto the roof uh, to go onto the the field. Sorry, and uh, we've been joined by Nakiji. So how are you doing, mate? I'm doing well, but I'm trying to get my PC to work. It just blue screened when I want <laughs> to log into the ops cam. <laughs> <laughs> that would be great. That would be actually. Yeah, great. it's great. Uh, <laughs> but let's hope it works now. Yeah. Did they did they start? On the stick actually I There is two LA's fighting on the roof. Alright, I might be a little bit late. Yeah, so they start but Yeah right, they started. <laughs> <laughs> so they finally started on to Xenotech Lab, so TR seems to be in control of uh of the building but one LA flanking everyone from behind I uh, should the double kill the LA got killed here by one heavy onto the stairs the bolter from TR is sitting onto the point will be joining this year onto the first round EMP then a concussion grenades to uh, deny the push from the VS VS are coming from the south side of the base and uh, right now, one TR was a bit uh, too eager to get some kills here, and uh, and got killed unfortunately. Big push coming from uh, from VS, all regrouping around the uh, around the rocks here, and uh, we have one data on the roof for the TR. The the heavies from the Yen from uh, from the VS decided to push inside the inside the building. The bolter is definitely dead for the TR. So. Finally, the the VS will contest the points. I guess your co cast is also gone, so... Yeah, don't worry. Uh, oh, you can co-cast with me, uh, Eros. Uh, no issue. Yeah, if you want, I'm... <laughs> Perfect. So, I will be joining with... Uh, I will be joined by uh, Eros, which is our referee here. And since he's the only referee, he doesn't want to sit alone onto a channel. And it will be my co-caster. Welcome, Herods. Yeah. <laughs> the referee channel are dark, cold, and I don't want to be there. Yeah. So, yeah. Nobody wants to be uh, in the referee channel. I, I really hope that I will not be... Uh, I will never be into a referee channel. Uh, and <laughs> always be into the caster channel, which is uh, a lot more fun, <laughs> I think. I like to ref, but... At the moment, I'll be the only one, and that's yeah. a little bit of 
Rory kind of things only watch the game and nobody you can talk with about mm. this fantastic round. A lot of PR gets a lot of point control and set up a great point control. I see some TR light assaults with ambush of flies to try to fly around. That's but getting killed from what? Was it Netrox? I guess. Yeah, that was Netrox. That's pretty nice. Uh, but do I have two? I think I have two instances of the the script running. All double. Yeah, all killer doubled. It's strange. Uh, yeah, really yeah strange. that's. That happens if you don't um, stop what around. I did. Yeah, if that what I did in the first round, um, I reopened the, my uh, my client twice, so they count this twice. So that means yeah. eh, that's why. So, so first cap for by the TR, you you were speaking of it, and uh, TR yeah. be, uh, building a lot of point control uh, result of the cap. So. Yes, they can't seem to be able to push onto the onto into the building. They are trying to force their way from the double doors, but that's so well guarded by the TR inside. You have the, you have one Walter. There is few heavies now pushing onto the rocks. The DLA is defending onto the roof, so the VS have to push back around the tree. They are not allowed to uh, go onto those areas. The LAs of VS trying to regain control of a little bit fighting onto the onto the the tree unfortunately for him he will meet his hand by the hand of uh, Slendy uh, I I don't see this play but yeah maybe I be on the VTR side at the moment so I don't see any light assaults are not in the area to be but eh. yeah it seemed that the light assault was onto the roof yes he is still onto the roof uh, that's a light assault of yes actually uh, but the tr uh, light assault is right behind him with the ambush jump jet get the down uh, the kill uh onto the vs here so netrox getting killed uh, once again, I, f I feel I really feel like Nitro is not having a bad uh, a, a good day here on to a light assault, uh, getting pressure every time. Itzy is playing heavy, uh, not as a light assault. He was doing amazing uh, on to the first match, and um, and yeah, for now VS uh, managed to kill the bolters, so they might have a uh, nice opportunity to um to come back into that building they will uh, investigate the first floor here uh, with a four man push as well as a bolter Dang. nice crossfire here onto the tr yeah, that entrance been so well guarded by uh, by the vs vs contesting the point the bolter watch out is onto the field uh, one heavy is trying to push Onto the low ground, he managed to get one, uh, but he got killed in the end as well. That's a, that's a fair trade here. The light assault with the, the ambusher got killed as well. That's a very really nice uh, line of sight uh, that you want to have with uh, with one heavy. The bolter got the kill from behind onto the other bolter. And uh, now 2VS versus 2 uh, TR right inside the points. Yes, being a bit uh, a bit shy to push but the concussion grenades no he, nobody killed that TR he got the kill onto the light assaults and right now yes they have a strong hold onto the point which is really important now they can play a real aggressive onto the building let's have a look that heavy is still alive I believe that's it see he really one uh, like to to run yes that's it see he's running the same helmet onto live server There we go. Still in control of the points there. So that's a plus 18 from the side of the TR being able to capture to fully capture the base. And now if VS manage to come back and cap the base, there will be a plus 36, I believe.
the Belter from the TR trying to push from the ground. And I'm back. Hey! hey. Hello, Osprey. Welcome back. So, Eyes open. Oh, how's it going? Oh! Plus two. Has there been a cap? Ah, uh, hey, yes. Yeah. There has been a cap uh, from by the TR. TR. So that means TR has. Slightly. Why do I. Oh, okay, the kills are doubled. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The kills are doubled on my uh, on my ends. I was about to say, why do I see networks getting so many frags? <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, the camera will get you some point. No, I mean, Boo. I was about to say, why are you guys not hyping it up? Because he got like five kills. <laughs> but no, that was just one. <laughs> Now the TR trying to push onto the point. Uh, that was a good push by the TR there with the bolter and two heavies. But the comeback is here by the by the VS one. The, the two v one. Uh, you got the trade, but uh, the reinforcement by the TR with the LA to come back and finish the kill. That's a two for one for the um, for the TR. Fight with the LA once again. Netrox, we, we were joking, but he's not having a good day here with the LA's. Kept on getting killed by the other one. HQ. Boys, even so, there's a back. There's been a cap for TR, I guess. Yes. Yep. Okay, so I mean, the side gives it. That, that side gives you the cap more easily. So, DDR, what they have to do is, if they can pick a bit of advantage on frag right now, and and cap the second half, it's totally doable for them. Or is it the second half? No, that's still the first one. Yeah, you okay. you came you came back early. Okay, that's perfect. They, what, okay, so DDR, what they have to do is keep up the good work and try to close in the gap, like even get the most kills they can while not dying. Yeah. They don't need to don't need to play for the recap. They oh, they the have the advantage on the second that shot. Doc P with a plus ten, that's great. The other side see Ryan only plus four, so might be still having difficulties. The way he plays bolt on this map might be bring him some some troubles. Because playing the bolt on the main door like that can be super punitive. Yeah, the bolter from the VSA is fighting uh, around the. Uh, I believe that in English that's called factory, but I'm not quite sure. Uh, powerhouse. Powerhouse for powerhouse for not factory. Uh, I, I know that in French we don't really call that building uh, anything. To be fair. Uh, maybe Jenny building. Yeah. Yeah, why not? Okay. Maybe because I'm that's the <laughs> building of uh, Jenny. Uh, another defense by the TR, which is uh, uh, important. But, uh, bring points, though. Yeah, but it's still important. Uh, it will deny any. That's the base is not capable by the the VS anymore. To be honest, a recap from the other side it is it's never happening. Impossible. Yeah, it can only happen if you have a super good run and have like three team wipes in a row. Yeah, and then commit to it. Other than this, I see a big push coming around dubs, double those and tree. They got inside the point, two frags for TR. Uh, the concussion grenades are thrown, those. there is Ron Heavy uh, onto the right stair, right into the middle. The 1v1 will be won by the Heavy in the end. That's a trade, that's, uh, that's a trade, a good engagement the thing is, by the TR. It was really a 1v1, it was more like a 4v2 in favor <laughs> of TR right now. Yeah, yeah, they, but the, the VS, strangely enough, managed to kill two TRs, so that's really important. Two died for, from the side of VS, but two died okay, as well so. from the side of TR. Yeah, VS did a good focus fire, and we see a repush from VS going strong on the double doors. Four guys, including the ball. Yeah, rockets being thrown right onto the door, just for pressure. The concussion nades thrown as well. One heavy is pushing right onto the stairs. He will be killed. Crossfire by the TR. Beautifully done. That's a two for zero oh for for the TR oh, into this team fight. Yeah. The, the whole is back, squad though. was here waiting, yeah. ready and waiting for that. 
that was telegraphed by the by the <laughs> by the VS. So the EMP right onto your soldier from the side uh -oh, uh -oh. of Ryan. Is there any push here? So three minutes uh, remaining into the into the round. The bolter is doing his job. Brian still getting some peeks here and there, protecting the double doors. Oh, missing that shot though. Let's have a look. Watch your stick. Infiltrator in the area. Yeah, let's see how the two are they can be. Uh... Yeah, they, they are waiting right so much. One, uh, one TR is down right onto the point. The concussion yeah, grenade. The two TR are down. Ren coming in strong. One more pick. Yeah, Hitsy decided to back off, but uh, or oh, Hitsy with the comment onto the onto the point, maybe he has the the underboss on hand and he got the kill. No, that's uh, that was uh, G Power, yes, in Power, uh, with the kill here with a uh, simple nub as well. So yes, very nice push. That was qu quite slow, but very nice push in the end. They got back the control of uh, the building, but not the point though. Or run and coming in alone. Going there, okay. Let's see if they clear the upper. MP. Where's the two. VS? I saw one VS dude on the Ah, there is still a there, couple there. of VS uh, onto the, the upper floor. Big Kong's coming in. Yeah. Big push from behind. The bolter misses the headshot here. Oh, Bolter got flank by a light assault. The 2v1 with the yeah. commissioner. That's a trade here. You have that's a much better than a trade. Okay. That's a two so for what one. What done amazingly is that I think it was Itzy on this on the VS stairs who mm -hmm. managed to kill that TR flanking and turned back and got two kills out of it. Yeah, that really saved that for VS. Really well done by him. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he'd say you, you can recon uh, recognize him by his helmet. Onto yeah, yeah. Uh, he decided to invest some Debra game, uh, Debra cash here, um, to get his uh, signature helmet. I would say onto um, onto life because on Cobalt he's playing uh, oh. that helmet as well. Is he holding the point? Ryan, oh, getting that kill! Nice shot from Ryan. Okay, so Ryan is in the rampage, he just got 3 kills in a row and just almost wipes the VS on his own. Yeah, but that VS in was a run in the end. Of round. He did great, he did great that at the point. That was triple from Ryan just before the end of round, giving a <laughs> good point advantage. Yeah. If you add that, that's... DDR now is gonna have to both cap and get back the point advantage on the frags. Yeah, so um, the scoreboard is a little bit bugged uh, because I, I think that I, I've launched uh, the script twice and therefore there was uh, each kill count uh, counted for double. So yeah, the score not really relevant, I think. Uh, what it shows is looks okay though. Yeah, that's kind of strange, but uh, yeah, I don't really know uh, or understand why it, it looks so good yeah i have some kills difference though okay that's because the um, no i think it's fine all right it's yeah. totally fine. if you find it fine I, uh, then i'm fine <laughs> no the points are not added yet bash and fluffy so that's plus 18 for uh five kph aka jock oh yeah yeah i should have it Been a lot of team kills. Yeah, there was uh, quite a few team kills. That they're trying to beat us, beat Ram on the team kills. Because uh, <laughs> now we have bets on who's gonna kill Bashar this game. Team kill Bashar. Uh, on that, I think Joke might be beating us right now. <laughs> DDR gaming as well. There we go. The cap counts. Yeah. The cats, uh, the cap That's has been still added. totally doable. Like 25 points isn't that big of a deal to 
come back, especially on this map where, like, the sides are both balanced and unbalanced in the fact that it's balanced in terms of what it gives you. Uh, one side can totally spawn lock you, while the other can totally go for the point without being disputed that much because of that point door. Yeah, the the point door is really important. So that you have, you have an, such an easy access of that uh, of the point here with that yeah, door. Yeah, but having the easy access without having the upper stairs it means that you're gonna get into trouble. That's where the map is is all about how you rotate, and that's why I like this map personally. Yeah, that was uh, yeah, the the rotation of both teams, but especially the one of TR was really excellent here on to that round. Always getting the point, then rotate around uh, and getting the control of the uh, of the upper floor, and um, controlling those doors uh, was really excellent. The double doors, and they at some point I they even push uh, around the around the rocks, and you always had like one heavy sitting right there, uh, providing some crossfire to to anyone trying to repush and the bolters tried as well to come and uh, the light is onto to the roof so that was really a trap set up by um by jokes here both teams seems to be ready or at least uh the vs are ready uh the tr knots they are subbing in uh they are subbing coach out so we'll have uh, a little sub here for coach excuse me <laughs> yeah, that's when I eat. <laughs> uh, so there was a documentation, yes, sir. Oh. Oh well, yeah, overall, a good showing. Yeah, a very, very good try. Um, what I can see is that, let's say I expected maybe a bit much from DDR, to be honest. A bit more, not much. Because um, even though I think it's not the most, the, the strongest roster joke, but right now it's the stronger roster, strongest roster they can align just for the fact that Two of the their main players are rusty right now. What I said earlier, but um, how to say that? I think I thought that uh, Joke might have a um, way harder time, especially on Paris. And looking at how what happened on the game yesterday, since we played them with Ram, but definitely like Zyros coming in. Like, he wasn't playing against us yesterday, I think HQ wasn't either, and that gives a really good help on net score, as far as I see. Yeah. Yeah, Xenotech Lab, uh, as you said, uh, okay. yep, so you were saying? No. I think he missed the, um, the whisper The key. whisper, <laughs> yeah, yeah. But it should be great uh, to have the whispers as well because sometimes uh, there is some calls that we are missing, and we we got so we got suddenly surprised that the game is actually started. Has it start? Not yet, not yet. Not oh, yet. it's starting in not fifteen. Yet. Fifteen. Can you do me a countdown? Yeah, obviously, Cheers. mate. Cheers. Ten. Oh, I'll let Erot, the master of countdown, oh, yeah. make it. Five. Four, three, oh yeah. two, one, start. There we okay, go. So I'm curious who subbed in for Koch. Uh, we will see. I we see will see. Ryan, the A flick, Zyros. Eyes on light assault HQ. HQ is there on to the. Oh, roof. Shrimp is there. Okay, that's a really strong. Jar lineup now. And Ren getting the first pick, but it's he trading. And the flank on the powerhouse, not spotted. Really big wipe. There from is the one still alive. No, the heavy got conked. 
he didn't he wasn't watching in the group the direction but that heavy is all alone he will get the pick here and tr back in control of the point vs they they have one heavy on uh on the upper floor so he will try to maintain some action here but uh the heavies the frontier that are on the point might go back and uh contest very strong crossfire in place for yeah. tr although yeah ju yes, yes jumping on point slandy wins the 1v2 thanks to the body shot from ryan really well done he has been hitting both heavies pushing but more trades coming in. I can't keep track. I think TR wins this. Yeah, they do. There has been trades all over the place, but those double body shots from Ryan just gave Slendy an easy 1v2 on that pawn. And I didn't so sh uh, shrimp doing one kill here. He's not uh, appearing onto the. No, no kill yet. Oh, he got assists on the push oh, earlier, yeah. but. Okay, big push on the side door for VS. Are they aware that one tier might drop behind them? No! And that's really well done! VS all rotating up on the double doors. Yeah, coming to, uh, coming strong on double doors. That's 5 mine push. One TR, oh, put TR. Uh, a flick uh, try to uh, go onto the, the stairs, but he got punished in the end. Yeah, Shrimp the finally, first, first kill off a Shrimp Is that here. Two kills? Uh, that I believe two kills that's two kills. Shrimp. I believe that's two kills from Shim. Trading two while dying there was amazing for him because it allows, let's see, the repush from his mates just coming in. Oh, but yeah, sadly, Netrox comes short. in and saves you there for extract. Respawns are there earlier for TR though. Are okay, they gonna repush? Let's see, Kong's on point. And here comes the push. Ryan coming in. I realize VS is not on the point anymore. Yep. It seems not. Oh, the VS Bolt are getting surprised in the back from the respawn from Zyrus. It's a lot of trades, but overall in favor of TR right now. Great crossfires. A flick and shrimp. Shrimp running away, baiting two guys into the aim of his teammate. And now Ryan is in control of the alley. Yeah, from the uh, from the powerhouse, it's going to be very really difficult to um, contest that bolter because he has been on fire so far into the into those matches, and um, and yeah, that crossfire from there to there is really insane. Ryan is really close to get contested though. He should come back maybe. Mm, yeah. Except if he gets the pick there. He gets the oh, bolter. No. His teammates. Oh, oh get the second one. He gets that the second one. Saving is there. And what? Oh, that, yes, the, the, the crossfire, the setup uh, to enable and Ryan to get some kills are, is just insane. And this Look is why I was, I was talking. And that's the cap. caps the base here. And that's because they were able to get to chain three team wipes. Yeah, that's yeah. the only way you cap on that side. And that's actually giving them a, I think, D for the win. Let's see how DDR Gaming can turn things around, but I don't see it happening. I, Judging out how TR is doing well right now. Oh, Ryan misses a couple of shots. Uh, going to be uh, going to be pressured here, and smartly enough, he's he will uh, he will retreat to uh, to the post through the powerhouse. Uh, TR still in control of the points, and um, it's he trying to work onto that door but watch out there is the infiltrator coming with the commissioner no it's with the bunny hop here putting pressure back onto Shrimp the infiltrator the see the thing is um ryan baits so much attention on the tree that his other heavies are able to reposition and get ready for the push mm -hmm. jar is totally in control in this game right now yeah they have the point, they have the opportunity, the setup, the, they have everything pretty much. And it's going to be so, and so hard for the... Punished. Yes. That was really out of position from Ryan. So let's see, two picks for VS. How is it going now inside? One more pick. That's the third one. Sandy trading the ball for that. Oh, the LA coming in alone. 
getting one pick but traded. That's five for two, so that's definitely a win for VS, but let's see how what they can do with that. So TR are they they will be trying to repush from the double doors here. Uh one heavy is sitting, yes, it's he with one of his teammates is sitting right onto the tree. Okay. Yes, did a big mistake there. They tried to contest the double doors, going through outside, while the TR respawn came in. Yeah. That's really mistimed. And look and at the light is on the roof! Oh, he got killed. He got a nice, nice cover by the by the bolter from the from the skinny stairs of the powerhouse. But TR back in control of the point. In network speaking, the bolter from TR shifted the obeyed the intention of TR towards the entrance, while the VS. The other VS came from the top, that's really well done. A lot of VS though on to the points. Three VS against one TR. He's all alone. He's all alone. It's managed to get two. one! He managed to get one that's definitely worth it. His oh. life is worth it. I think he got two as well here. Right on to the got points. Two and, and got time and about time to Zaros to come in the point yeah. and trade. That's insane from Slendy. 1v3 there. 1v3 shrimp with his uh, zebra. Is that the zebra camo? I think it's the stripes. Uh, stripes, yes. Alright. But Ryan zebra wear stripes. So basically synonyms. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Here, uh, TR still in control. So the bolter will be moving with shrimp. And uh, yep. Shrink may be baiting some uh, some of the VS into the hame of his bolter here. I In think the meantime, VS is totally underestimating the power of the powerhouse because they're always like coming to the tree, taking control of the tree, and one heavy from TR comes in from the powerhouse and wrecks havoc. It's he go on to the roof. Nice hack here by uh, by Hitsi. Uh, using the game mechanics, the game engine, I would say, uh, more in to, uh, to, to really deny and assert dominance onto the roof. But do VS really need an AV onto the roof? Uh, okay, Ryan changed his position. They know that he's been playing a lot on the other side, so now he plays around the main door. Although he totally didn't expect the LA, yeah. and he dies to it. Yeah, uh, I think that's the reason why they put it C onto the roof, just uh, in oh, order to upstairs. for the LA to to play elsewhere. Oh, so sad. A flick tried to balance the lost of his members on double doors, and Slendy running in, not aware it seems about those three VS. He should have been. He should have been one of his teammate was down onto the onto the. the the first floor, so was kind of suicidal here from uh, from the TR. The bolter is playing into the the s small eye shaped building here um, on the east side of the points. Yeah, it's in position in dubs, having co help with simple, but their teammates outside got wiped by the flank from Shrimp and the LA. So they're gonna go like 2v4 on this. Let's see how it goes. Simple picking one. And not ah, too got sad. Killed. That's a trade here. The revenge kill. Watch out. The Light Assault got one as well. Onto the, the first floor. And that's the TR back in the strong position. Inside the building at Xenotech yeah. Lab. Full wipe for just one death. Mm, that's yeah. very, very strong. And now back to, into the aggression. Back into the spawn kill. Ryan with the bolt. Going, uh, going ham with the long distance kill behind the fences. And nobody is safe. You're not safe, guys. You're not safe. Okay, I just realized something. Shrimp is not a. He's not on the. On the good outfit. Is he on the. No, he's in the outfit. Oh, but he's no. not in the scoreboard. He is in 5k pH. I see him. Uh, yeah, alright. No, it's at the moment I only see. If I if my script works correct, it's only coach only in this and not actual scrim. So that means his skills don't don't matter. Doesn't count. That's yeah. Pretty but at the moment, it really looks 
pretty nice for t for TR. Yeah, yeah definitely they, they... won't change that much, but yeah, Shrimp is not appearing. Yeah. They they still need to we still need to count the plus eighteen of the cap and uh that's four minutes remaining. VS will not be able to recap that base. Uh, and um, and yes, and that's already nearly a 100 point game. Without the plus 18. Marshal, Look at Ryan here. Oh, misses the shot onto the heavy, heavy I back with the, the med kits, but he got killed and pressure by, um, by one heavy as well. So... VS is totally spawn locked, except the, the LA on the roof. Losing yeah, the that LA on the roof, Losing but he got trade. killed. And all the TR are outside right now. Let's have a look from the bolter side of uh, the VS. Very few line of sight when uh, once you get uh, once you get spawn locked. Very few opportunities. Oh my God! He got Ryan. That was insane! That headshot onto Ryan, beautifully done by the bolter, uh, bol by the old, sorry, the bolter of uh, VS here. Still watching yeah, the but sadly, he seems to go totally wide. Yeah. It's not for that kill from Natrox. Still following the bolter here. Yolda going sneaky into enemy territories. <laughs> it's so strange to say enemy territories when uh, that side is supposed to belong to VS, but that's that mean how much the that's how much the the dominance of TR is into that round. Yolda being pressured by one AV uh, from uh, from afar here, but Shrimp Shrimp is here. He kid uh, his skill doesn't count, so he's only doing assist here. <laughs> and HQ with the kill in the end. Oh yeah, no, it's getting it's super messy on DDR side right now. Oh yeah. They're going each on their own and doing their stuff. It's it though, inside the powerhouse. Let's have a look. Let's see, powerhouse. Where is he? He's on. He's he he was out. on the roof. He uh, jumped he down. inside the powerhouse. Oh, uh, I, I totally missed him then. <laughs> Watch out, the conk. Will deny NC uh, to uh, to come inside it's from the low ground, but he will be pushing top from top high ground. Shrimp is going to get surprised. Yeah, yeah. I'm That's really surprised true. that he, he did he got killed. Yes, he, did, he got killed in the end. But there was so many bullets by the oh, both heavies Ryan here. With the AMR heavy now. Battle rifle heavy. Oh no. <laughs> Getting team killed as well. Fine. Uh, I know team that's kill. an NG. He's on NG in here. <laughs> He's just messing around here. Hey, did he take the archer or thing like this? Make it complicated for the bolter. <laughs> it's he winning the trades upstairs. That's two picks yeah. for VS. That's two picks for VS. Finally, uh, they will assert dominance here for uh, from the time being onto the the building. Ryan just naded himself. I know. It, I don't know if he realizes. <laughs> <laughs> the nade pops on his face. One minute remaining to the rounds. And there is not much uh, VS can do here except like do not get killed. Uh, beautifully done here. The the double engagement by the VS here onto the onto the stairs. One VS dropping onto the point trying to get the the light assault here. The light assault turn his back but he's dead by that heavy Doctor yeah, Psycho, this is what VS pay. Have done for the whole game, but yeah, rotate, they, keep on rotating. They, they totally, um, I don't know. It's like their brains blanked out for several minutes and gave such an advantage to you. Yeah, this they really, me, yeah. uh, as you, uh, as you said, you repointed really out yeah. is they misunderstood and miscalculated the, the power that gave the no puns intended. The, the powerhouse uh, when the TR were sitting in the, into that building, and and yes, that was that was kind of the mistake of VS not using that powerhouse that uh, that angle here and not defend attacking that angle the contesting Ryan that was a big mistake, and that's it end of the match end of the match that's going to be GG for jokes once again. That's uh, that will be a 100 point game with a plus 18 of the cap.
that's all. Let's add the 100, uh, the, let's not add the 100, but more like the 20, the 18. And that's it. 109, if my math are correct, and they might be, they might be correct, yes. <laughs> yeah. And, um, and yeah, that's, uh, that's going to be it for, uh, for us, for tonight. And uh, I think there is a third match um, later, which is uh, Amer uh, an American match, will be casted by uh, Snipso. Uh, he told me that he's going to get drunk, which might be hilarious. Yep. A bit of commentary on the on the, the scoreboard, maybe. Mm -hmm. uh, kind of sad. I, I didn't quite understand why shrimp wasn't counted into the kills. Okay, so. I might have um, a reason. There's it, been pickups yesterday, so he might have switched outfit for the pickups. Oh yeah. And since he joined the outfit and the API wasn't refreshed on the mm -hmm. on the outfit creation, maybe the outfit join wasn't refreshed refreshed either. Yeah. So um, that might be why shrimp is not showing. Yeah. So yeah. that's the the same issue as the the previous like the first match we we we've guessed yep. with the the broke not being. Uh, was so new as an outfit that uh, they were counted as uh, such. So, all right. So, unfortunately, that so in terms of scores, in terms of scores, ladies and gentlemen, the score it, that was basically a five v six in terms of score. So, imagine to add up like if you were to ask like shrimp, what is uh, the number of kill and the ball of death he had? It should be it should be around twelve net score shrimp. Yeah. yeah. That might be even uh, the gap I'm might be actually. even wider. Uh, where's shrimp? Shrimp, shrimp, shrimp. Shrimp, shrimp, shrimp. What is your it's KD? Not showing. Yeah, it's not showing on the activity. So. Yeah. Oh, is there? Is he? No. What the fuck? Okay, I'm getting <laughs> trolled. <laughs> <laughs> now, um, you don't have that many kills. L uh, like uh, lower than ten, definitely. Yeah. But his net score should be around plus 10, I think, because mm. he didn't die at all. Uh, I think he, he, he died a couple of times, but uh, yeah, I do agree with you that his net score might be positive, at least. He's definitely positive. But yeah, overall, I think it was a really poor showing from DDO. They might not be really prepared on uh, Xeno and got a bit lost, especially on the second side. The way they rotated, yes. Yeah, they they really were lost on that second half, and uh, Joke totally jumped on that. And as soon as they got the upper hand, they went full spawn lock. And DDR had no, let's not say how no clue, but no counter to that. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes, I. So yeah, I definitely agree. strong showing from Joke. I think they were really more impressive than yesterday, which kind of scares me personally. But <laughs> 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 all right, all right. So I think that's going definitely, to be it for us. Yeah. Then. I think that's that definitely that, that resumes the state of let's say the top tier right now. DDR has a chance in that top tier, although they they lack a bit firepower maybe, and but they have some team play. They just have to work on it. But on the other side, Joke is waking up the. It's like a beast waking up. Yeah. And they have a very very strong chance at winning the whole thing now. So we will see later. But are you scared? Are you are, are you scared? It's not scared. It's that <laughs> I'm. Uh, how you say that? I'm just w watching how strong Being, they can be. Yeah. And yeah, I think everyone can beat. Everyone on the top tier can beat each other. You so like DDR wasn't that far on the first side, no, and yeah. with a bit stronger showing, they might have been able to turn the table. So you never know. Yeah, it's true that DDR like fell short um, every time on the second half. Uh, first half was really close, uh, even though there was a cap on to Xenotech and but Paris, uh, Paris uh, and Xenotech first half was really really close. So uh, if they keep the that momentum, is they keep the um, that. Um, uh, the, that close match, uh, having a better strategy, a better rotation, especially on Xenotech, might allow them to um, to oh. 
to win some games uh, here and there. So, so yeah, uh, okay. that's going to be it for us, guys. Uh, thank you very much, Osprey. Thank you very much, uh, Heroes, for uh, uh, co-casting with me and Heroes for uh, refereeing as well uh, for the game. Uh, it was a pleasure, and even though that was quite difficult with the with the script, <laughs> uh, I am pretty sure the preseason is there for a reason, and we will be all ready and uh, and hype for uh, the tournament in April. So so yeah, see you later, guys. Uh, there is a sun match uh, later that day. Uh, I don't quite know the time, but um, yeah, keep watching the Discord. There will be plenty of information. Bye-bye, guys. See ya.